Here at REC, for us it's really about creating access to the important resources for creative talent here in Philadelphia to thrive through their passions. For us, it's about helping artists see themselves as creative entrepreneurs and be able to build a livelihood to own their future here in the creative economy of Philadelphia. Our community was some of the most affected when it came to their ability to earn revenue because they were so used to getting out on stage or in front of people. Social distancing ended that. So for us, we were able to use our positioning right between the creative community and the business community and with the support of some really incredible organizations, we were able to raise over $25,000 of micro grants to put right directly into the hands of creators who were in need at this time. Hi, I'm Jim Burnett. I'm the Executive Director of the West Philadelphia Financial Services Institution. We at the Chamber have the unique opportunity to be a part of Philadelphia's recharge and recovery. But it has to be an equitable recovery so that all of Philadelphia's businesses and residents have an opportunity to participate. Hello, my name is Suleiman Rahman. I am the CEO of Diverse Force. Uh, I've worked with the Chamber over the last two years on the Inclusive Growth Initiative and more recently as a board member. And I'm really excited about the Collective Impact Initiative to recover and recharge PHL, particularly around the idea of making Philadelphia a leader in supporting black, brown, and locally owned businesses. I hope that you see the value in this initiative and join us. Thank you. In order for our city, region, and country to prosper for all, it's imperative that new wealth is created through diverse entrepreneurship. Antoine Johnson, a minority and woman-owned construction company, exists in part because of the power of mentorship, specifically because of the mentorship of Emily Bittenbender. I am fortunate of the bond we forged. Emily has been there through small and major hurdles and has helped me win work. And although we're competitors now, we continue to help one another. Collectively, we can do better if individually we each take a singular step and help a small, diverse business.